Hello guys, back with The Flash. We're on Season 2, Episode 10. It's called Potential Energy. So guys, man, the last episode we've seen uh, Zoom basically made uh, Dr. Wells make a decision on either saving his daughter or taking uh, Barry's speed, which of course I think any person would go on the other side to protect their daughter. So he decided to, I'm going to help, help Zoom to take, you know, uh, Barry's speed. So, man, that's not going to look good, man, because, you know, uh, Barry did forgive Dr. Wells, at least the other Dr. Wells, so he doesn't you know he's not mad at this dr wells for earth too but now if dr wells does something to barry like this it's not gonna look good and he's it's gonna put even a more bad image on him and the other doc you know of course the other dr wells uh, he's gonna probably think like they're all the same they're all like this you know it's not gonna it's not gonna look good at all the trickster was amazing of course with mark hamill like he's just the best villain ever he just plays the villain so well i just enjoy i thoroughly enjoyed him in that episode I, you could just definitely see it from my reaction like just he was just amazing. Joe got to see his son for the first time, uh, Wally West, and it was just uh, pretty, you know, crazy to see him. Like, they do look alike. You can tell they look pretty similar to each other. You could definitely see on uh, Joe's eyes that how surprised he was and how shocked he was, and he just, he didn't know what to say. I don't know how I would feel if I was in this position. I think I probably would do the same thing, just don't know what to say. Because, of course, he doesn't know him, but he knows that his that's his son. And he, I think his son felt like he was intruding, but course not of course he wasn't intruding you know with joe patty did have a, a beef with uh martin you know he because of what martin did to his father you know to her father and she wanted revenge and i'm glad that barry you know talked her out of that as well guys i definitely can't wait to see his next episode of the flash we're pretty much halfway done until season two it will be done uh, i just can't wait to get to more of these seasons in the future uh, but he's, he's just so far it's just a great season but anyway guys before this video begins guys i want to thank tom for sponsoring this video through the patreon page make sure you just go on the page get the full reaction on there and also support the channel as well and then guys let's get into this next episode for the flash oh, oh my oh uh, uh, careful oh Whoa. sorry oh my God. it's all good <laughs> it's all good <laughs> Oh my god, that was a dream. Oh! Captain. Why well, you meet somebody? This is my son, Wally West. Handsome young man, Joe. Hey, he's a West, he can't help that. Your pops here is a hell of a detective. Obviously not. Pleasure to meet you, Wally. Hey, no, absolutely not. You don't get to throw somebody else's stuff when you're pissed off. <laughs> Thank you. I still think we can figure out a way to make Zoom slower. We tried that already, remember? Those darts didn't slow him down at all. Yeah, I know. I'm not talking about the darts. I'm talking about something else. A way we can steal Zoom's speed. How? The turtle. Perpetrators who committed this heartless crime have been apprehended and are now in our custody. We're happy to report that the famed Vandervoort diamonds have been returned to their rightful owner. Getting that return to the family is what's most priceless to me. Gotcha. Ring is gone. What happened to it? Lock this place down. No one leaves this room. Okay, I think we can call it. Wally is not coming. I'm sorry, Joe. I know how much this meant to you. He's a kid, right? I get it. He could have at least called. You've been quiet all evening. Had a lot on my mind. Patty? We we may have met for coffee. Yes. She really cares about you, Barry, and she's just wondering why you've been so guarded. She did mention that you've been having nightmares. About Zoom. Killing her. You realize you can't keep things from her forever, right? One day, you're gonna have to tell her the truth. Yup. Then I'm the Flash. I wish a year ago you had told me the truth. So what? You think that I should just tell her? I think that if you are serious about being with her, you're gonna have to. You have to. I think we found the next target for our 30 something meta human, not a ninja turtle. How long did it take you to come up with that one? It just came out of my mouth. Did you see that? That was amazing. <laughs> I'm gonna tell Patty. That I'm the Flash. Is that a bad idea? What do we think? I will say, she put bullets in King Shark and Harry. Yeah. So as far as I'm concerned, that's Team Flash material to me. Yes. Thank you, Cisco. Yeah. Thank you. Harry, I'm gonna her do dad. this. I'm gonna tell her. Don't tell her. You care for this woman. Keep her as far away from this as possible. And here's why. 
if Zoom finds out who you care for, who you love, they'll take them from you. All right, keep your eyes open for the turtle. A sentence I never thought I would say. I can't figure you out very, Alan. That is because I work hard to hide who I really am. We've got eyes on turtle. Oh my God, of course. Barry, you were saying? I'm sorry. What? What? B Barry! CCPD, freeze! Oh my God. Whoa! Are you as fast as a flash? Oh no. He is much slower. I'm slow, not stupid. Things went a little sideways after your girlfriend decided to go out lethal weapon one through four on Turtle. God, Patty's gonna think I ditched her. I No, I gotta go. Finding Turtle is what's important right now. Yeah, uh, this is important to me too. We need to see if your speed still works. It works. I, th I think it still works. We still have to find out how Turtle drained him of it. Oh my God. Oh, this is gonna be so awkward. I was right. I thought that you would look mad, and you do. Just I don't tell really her. have a good excuse. I'm actually really upset. Look, we've been having fun, and fun has been so great. I'm moving past fun to the close part. You need to figure out what it is that you want. Oh, he does racing? I just... You got someone tailing me now? Why didn't you show up for dinner last night? I couldn't make it. You tell someone you're gonna be somewhere, you show up. I guess I didn't have my dad to teach me that, huh? I don't actually have to explain myself to you. Actually, you do. This is illegal. I'm a cop, remember? Oh, yeah. Yes, the detective who didn't know he had a son and who doesn't know anything about me. I'm trying to get to know you. Is that car that I want? That's the only way that I can pay for my mom's hospital bills. Get her the help that she needs. Go home to your family, Joe. Resentment. Damn, man. Right? Hey. Turtle, what the heck? What do you want from me? The thing most precious to the flash. You. What do you want from me? I want you to stop moving forever. What do you get out of killing me? Oh, I'm not gonna kill you. You don't have to hurt me to try to prove a point. This isn't about hurting you. This is about hurting someone who values you. Oh, Barry? No. The Flash. What does he have to do with this? I saw the way he saved you. Yes, that's what he does. My wife, Rosalind, took me for granted. She wanted to leave me the thing I valued most. You're hurt because your wife left you. I couldn't let that happen, so I made her mine. Oh, no. <laughs> Her. His ex-wife used to be an archivist for antiquities at the Nadel Library before it shut down. It shut down three months after the accelerator exploded. That place is big enough to hold turtle stuff. Barry, we haven't even figured out how to neutralize the turtle's power. Well, I, I'm gonna have to power through it. All right, I'm outside the library. Barry, the only way to save Patty is if you grab her in between each of the turtle's pulses. You'll only have two tenths of a second to make your move. He doesn't care about you as much as I thought. No, no, please. Uh, get him. So you want to know my new definition of irony? You are our most prized possession. <laughs> Why didn't you tell me that you're sick? You sick? The champagne. You know I lost my husband. How hard that was for me to move on. How could you let me get close to you knowing that soon I'd lose you too? Didn't expect this. Didn't expect you. Then help me find a cure. Hey. I think I left my sweater here the other night. 
Green. Heading back to Keystone tonight. It's a fast trip. Yeah, well, it's getting a little hot in Central City for me. You know, if you're waiting for an apology, it's not coming. No, I'm, I'm the one that should be apologizing to you. I felt bad not being there while you were growing up. I'll try to be your instant dad, and you won't have to pretend that you want to be my son. Deal? Will that food for you? Doesn't have to be. I like Kung Pop Chicken. There you go. That's a start. You guys. Oh, my God. Patty. Hey. Hi. Um, can we talk? No, now's not really an awesome time. I have a mound of paperwork on my desk I need to finish, so I'm, I'm sorry, I okay. can't. No, no, okay, real, really quick. I've been closed off and weird and um, all the things that you said I was, but uh, mostly I have not been honest. I'm leaving Central City. What? I always wanted to be CSI. And four years ago, I was accepted into the forensic science program at Midway City University. So it's time to move on. Damn! Break from the job. From everything. From everything. I wasn't honest. Thinking earlier today about the time that you were four, I took you to the planetarium, just you and me. But it was in the Mars exhibit that I lost you. Panic. <laughs> I had that place locked down. In one minute, I had every security guard looking for you. Road and something else. Oh, no. Rising also some dark instinct. What I would do to the person who had taken you, unspeakable thing. Oh, my God. And it was in that moment I realized for certain I would do anything to get you back. No. Ear bar. Thought. Oh my god. How? Gideon. Professor Thorne? Where the hell am I? You've got to be freaking kidding me. Thorne is back. Are you freaking. What? He, tra he traveled back in time. Oh. Um he doesn't even know where he's at, so this got to be a different guy. I don't, I, don't, I don't even know. Maybe he's the same guy. Oh my lord. Barry, obviously, it's not. it doesn't look like Wells, but. He's still gonna be pissed if he sees him. But I think that maybe Thawne will help Barry defeat Zoom. Maybe. That could be a thing. I'm already seeing, I'm already, you know, thinking of the possibilities right now in my head or like what could, you know, what could be, what routes could go. I think it's either Thawne could help Barry or maybe Thawne would be against Barry with Zoom. Who knows? But I think, I think the more likely choice is gonna probably be uh, Thawne helping Barry defeat uh, you know zoom that's gonna be crazy if that ha if that happens I don't know I'm already thinking the whole possibilities that's just insane I was not expecting that he's the last person I was expecting that was a huge surprise oh yeah this is this is gonna be good I was not expecting Patty to move on from Barry and you know Central City I was not expecting that but I get why she's feeling that way um, I understand because you look Barry wasn't honest but from his not being honest he lost her and you know she it was easy for her to decide not to you know not to not stay it was easy for her to make that decision i mean even though we already know the future of barry you know because barry does marry uh, uh iris so we already know that but i was wondering even with patty i was wondering how he broke up with her and I, this is probably the this is the reason why what happened a turtle was just something else that power is, is like pretty much kryptonite to barry but he overcame it and defeated a uh, turtle uh, but we already knew that from his power, uh, we already know uh, Harrison Wells was going to take that and use it against Barry because that's what he's going to do. He took a DNA from a uh, turtle and that was, ugh, it was gruesome. Another thing is with Joe and his son, look, I get why his son felt that way. I get why he did it because technically, look, Joe wasn't around and he might not have that type of same, you know, that type of respect for him because he felt like, you know, he, of course, you know, while he didn't feel like he was there and, and he should have been there. And he wasn't, but I, I feel like that wasn't Joe's fault because he wasn't told by uh, Francine. So I feel like it wasn't his fault, but at the same time, he's doing whatever he can to patch it up right now. And I'm, I'm glad he's doing his best and they're starting with, you know, doing, you know, eating Chinese food. That's good. I'm glad that's going well. Guys, please post your comments down below. Tell me think about this awesome uh, episode from The Flash. I just cannot wait to see the next episode with uh, Thawne. That's just going to be crazy. Make sure you guys go on the Patreon page to get the full reaction on there and also support the channel as well. Other than that, guys, hope you guys have a wonderful day. I'll see you guys next Flash.